Good morning, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, this is another morning for us to give thanks to God. Adore God for who He is in our life. In life, you must be accountable to somebody. You are a being which is God. Tell Him thank you for keeping you to today. We don't know the secret behind anything. You don't know the secret behind the sun. You don't know the secret behind the moon. You don't know the secret behind rain and sun. Whatever. But it's another time for us to appreciate him and give him praise. Honor him and tell him thank you. Because he is God. Because he is king. Because he is Lord. Appreciate him now. Appreciate him now. Tell him thank you. Give him praise because he, he can never change. Our declaration for the day. First Peter chapter 5 verse 1 to 10. Verse 10. That the God of all grace. Who have called us unto his eternal glory by Christ. Jesus. After that ye have suffered a while. Make you perfect, establish, strengthen, and say to you. The only action word I will take that you suffer a while. After you suffer a while, establish and say to you. Mm, too many persons in life right now, as I'm talking, what they are saying is the last point before their promotion. What is the last point before your promotion? The last point before your promotion is a point you reach before you have been settled. Not everything you face are what we face you of. Something you face in life are what we face you on. Never you conclude any condition before it starts. Some conditions are the other side of your miracle. When you see that there is darkness, night comes, remember that wants to be a day. Anytime you see the rainy season wants to be concluded, know that there will be dry season. God create one season after another season. And that is the reason why when you see that the particular season want to end, another season want to start. No season come to compete with another season. That is not the creation. The creation. Life is being created for every season to be dependent and free his time. Whoever you see celebrating today has finished his season. Season did not come to kill you. It comes to mold you. There are many things you could have not known in life if that period did not come. Mm. God walk like a God walk like companies. That before he will commit you to anything, he will send you to training. If you're close to NMPC worker, somebody will tell you that I'm going to a training in Lagos. To do what? Maybe they wanted to keep him in an office, what they did not know about. So they would train him first before they use him. God trained before he used. Never you key yourself for what you're going through. Because it's a training that he wants to give you to use you. You are a raw material. And nobody uses raw material in that form. They will refine you. After they refined you, you become a product. Those people that live around here, they know that there is what they call crude oil. I don't know how they call it in their language. Maybe it might be the one they call MPK. I don't know. But for the state that crude oil brings cuisine, bring diesel, bring um, gas, bring petrol, 
or bring whatever does not mean you will carry crude oil and pour inside your car. You must refine it. Don't misinterpret your refining period. Though it comes to make you a real product. God make you who you want to be out of that raw material. Sir, relax yourself. No settlement comes so cheap. It comes with an experience. Anytime you see it getting more tough, know that it's closer to your miracle. Is it poverty? You'll be so rich that people will come and beg money from you. Is it hatred? Men will so love you that other person will come around. Is it frustration? God wants to lose you. Put yourself together. Snuff or wave away whatever condition you're facing now. It's about to be concluded. This is your night. And remember, weeping may endure just for a night. If it is suffering, it must come. Because it's a preparation of where you're going. Sir, never you allow the intention, command your attention. For God is on your work. Relax, he will do it for you. I pray for you this morning. In this witherness experience, may you come out with victory. And we are the crown by which God has set for you. Palakia Suprata, in the name of Jesus. And I decree today that those who are mocking, laughing at you, they will celebrate with you. I encourage you this morning, through the power of the Holy Ghost, it will soon be over. Go, for they will not mock you anymore. He will settle you in Jesus' name. Amen. Good morning. Sorry for the late coming. I still remain your boy and your brother, your friend, your mentor, Uncle Bro George. Good morning. Happy weekend. I promise you that this weekend will be the best. God will wave and put everything off your way. In Jesus' name. Amen.